Now, some hospitals in Brevard have already been evacuated. Shelters are now open. Yeah, News 6's James Barrero joins us from North Brevard County in Satellite Beach. And James, you're starting to see some bigger waves there right now. Is that right? I think, Ginger, this is the beach erosion that we're fearing. We, I think we're starting to see it right now here in Satellite Beach. This is a usual location where we see the beach erosion. This is the beach access where the old Sun on the Beach restaurant was. It's got a new location in town, but the Papagallo's Pizza Restaurant is here. And I'll show you where the tide was when we got here about an hour ago. It was right up here to the beach steps already. It's a little bit lower right now, but if you come back here down on the beach, I want to show you why this is so important, sad, because the county just spent upwards of $10 million or so after hurricanes Matthew and Irma in 2017 to rebuild these dunes you're looking at. I can remember at this house here on the left of your screen, we'll pan to the left and we'll show you this home right here. So I was up on that deck after Irma in 2017 and it was a sharp, steep, vertical drop right down to the beach about 20 feet. The whole dune was just gone. So it makes you think we could see the same thing very much here again. The beaches in Satellite Beach may be half as wide as some of the other beaches in the county. This, of course, bringing the evacuation concerns with the mandatory evacuations now in order. We're talking to residents that we're finding beachside, some of them at beachside bars that are still open. There are a few. Here's what they think about the percentage of who's leaving and who's staying. I think that it's probably a 50-50 because a lot of people here are Floridians. They don't really care about storms. They don't take it seriously. Um, but I do think that it is important to evacuate if you do feel like you're in danger. If you feel you're in danger and you are not evacuating, maybe you can't evacuate. There are 10 shelters, I believe, is the number that are opening tonight at 5 o'clock across Brevard County. If you're in central Brevard County, like Satellite Beach, Cocoa Beach, Merritt Island, we think the closest one would be the community center on US-1 in North Cocoa. We've got a full list of the details of what you would need to bring and the addresses of those locations. That's on clickorlando.com. Matt, Lisa, Ginger, we'll be back here at 4 o'clock. We're going to continue to monitor how the beach holds up here in Satellite Beach. It's not a good sign early on. Back to you. Yeah, you can see it start to happen already. James Barbero live for us. James, we'll see you later. Thank you.